Anderson is very admirably clear about what it values in terms of its of the website. Not all schools are so clear. Um, and the website says that Anderson values people who share success, think fearlessly, and drive change. Now, applicants who share those values will naturally be drawn to, to, to Anderson. How can they convey that they share those values via their application? Uh, great question. So when you look at all of the different materials that people need to submit, there's just some natural parts of, say, that real estate that people can put down, say, for example, the shared success. You have your resume. You know, there's great opportunities to put down hobbies, interests, as an example there. You can also obviously share that in your essays. So there's a lot of control around that. And that's where we really want to know who you are as a person. We want to know you have a plan about getting an MBA too. Um, another area is the interview itself. That's just a great way to have a conversation with a current MBA student who does facilitate the interview. And in that sense, that interviewer who's been trained is going to be looking for those qualities. They're going to be asking you about you know, not only why you want to get an MBA, why you want to get an a MBA from Anderson. So that's a great way for a candidate to showcase their knowledge about the program, their uh, interests or plan on how they're going to make an impact on the campus in and of itself. Um, the transcripts, the standardized test score, that's all going to show us your ability to do well academically, as well as in some cases, if you may have had an academic you know, challenge in your undergrad, show us how you uh, may have rebounded. OK, um, the letters of rec, another way to demonstrate, you know, how from a, a third person about some feedback maybe you received and how you responded, your highest level of qualities um, that you did in the workplace or whatever community organization you provided. So there's just a lot of different ways to be strategic about how am I going to show UCLA Anderson? This is the community that I want to be a part of that values all those that you mentioned. And I know. With the first two, you know, uh, think fearlessly, drive change. You know, many schools talk about how they have very smart people. They're they're changing the world, right? Um, and Anderson, you know, values that too. But we really believe we own that third piece, the shared success model. And like I mentioned before, in all those areas, there's just different ways that you can showcase that and say, like, okay, I'm part of a community. I've made it better. Um, I'm going to do the same thing at Anderson. <laughs>